Na muna tazama tarifa za Kate Leo Jumatano karibu tena. Mvutano kati ya serikali ya kaunti ya Nakuru na usimamizi wa hospitali ya Nakuru War Memorial bado unaendelea. Serikali ya kaunti kikaidi amri ya mahakama Afisa ukuwasilisha amri za mahakama alifika katika hospitali hiyo ambapo askari wa kaunti walikataa kupokea amri hiyo. Haya mejiri huku msimamizi mkuu wa hospitali hiyo akiandikisha taarifa kwenye makao ya DCI na Kuru akidai kupokea vitisho kuhusu maisha yake. Ken Gashuhi na taarifa zaidi. Kwa mara ya pili afisa wa kuwasilisha amri za mahakama alifika kwenye hospitali inayozozaniwa ya Nakuru War Memorial amri ya jaji Millicent Odenyi ikiwa mkononi Jameni sheria unajua si mfungue basi nione nani yuko ndani muruhusu tu tuingie sisi ni afisa wa koti tuingie tuone nani wako ndani kama hakuna mtu basi tutaeleza mahakama. Jaji Odenyi alitoa amri hiyo Jumanne akielekeza serikali ya kaunti kuondoka katika hospitali hiyo na kuirejesha kwa usimamizi binafsi wa Nakuru War Memorial. This morning we were able to serve the AG's uh, chambers. We served the uh, 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 state council who was concerned in the matter. He accepted service. We went to serve the same upon the Nakuru County commander, uh, police commander. He was said to be out of the office, but we left a copy of this order. And it's unfortunate that uh, they have now denied us a success. People who have patience this idea, they cannot be able to accept. It's quite unfortunate that court orders are being disobeyed. Kufikia jioni kamanda wa polisi kaunti ya Nakuru Samuel Ndanyi, ambaye alitakiwa kuhakikisha amri hiyo imetekelezwa haku wa amepatikana. Mamia ya wafanyikazi wa hospitali hii ambayo kwa sasa imebaki kufungwa chini ya ulinzi mkali, wakipiga kambi upande wa nje na kuzuiwa kuingia. From morning, we have just been waiting and waiting to see what is going to happen. And we had a lot of expectation, we had a lot of hope that uh, we'll get in because uh, as uh, staff and professionals we knew automatically we'll get in but it didn't happen so in total on that day we had 17 patients uh, we had a critical patient in icu we had a patient in hdu and uh, I understand they were mof, moved out. Miongoni mwa wagonjwa waliokuwa wamelazwa hapa kabla ya kuhamishwa kwa lazima ni mweka hazina wa muungano wa wanao miliki matatu David wa Madhingira aliyekuwa anapokea huduma kwenye chumba cha wagonjwa mahututi na ambaye aliaga dunia saa chache baada ya kuhamishiwa hospitali nyingine. Upon the transfer because we are made uh, to understand that the uh, situation caused uh, so much tension that the patient had to be transferred and unfortunately that patient is no more courtesy of these entire uh, fracas. Malikuwa uh, treasure la wetu na tukawa na anjangileono kidogo jinzi vile tutaweza kukua na mikakati ya kumpeleka afumzike. Kimani wa madhingira amekuwa wa msaada kupwa sana kwa mungano wetu. Mkurugenzi wa hospitali hii Patricia Musale aliandamana na wakili wake hadi ya fisi za wapelelezi wa jinai na kituo cha polisi cha kaptembo aliko andikisha tarifa kuhusu vitisho alivyo pokea kupitia rununu. OB number 33 of 24th January 2024. We hope the police will take up the issue with the seriousness it concerns because she really feels her life is under threat just for doing her own work at the hospital. Jumatano jioni hospitali hii ilibaki kufungwa askari wa kaunti wakielekeza wagonjwa kutafuta huduma kwingine. Kesi iliyowasilishwa na kampuni ya Nakuru War Memorial mahakamani ikitaka serikali ya kaunti kuondoka hospitalini humo itatajwa tena Alhamisi. Kenga Shohi KTN News. Wakati